All right, it is big movie time. What to see, what to wait on. Mark Walters from BigFanboy.com is joining us to get us the scoop. Hey, Mark, how are you, buddy? Doing good, Mitch. Getting all ready for San Diego Comic-Con. I know, man. This is going to be a blast. I'm sure we're excited about that. And some of the big talkers over the weekend, Transformers 3 is what everybody's talking about. Uh, is the magic still there? You know, it's funny. Michael Bay knows how to make popcorn movies. That's the one thing you can say about the guy. You can hate him all you want, but he knows how to make big popcorn movies. And who doesn't like seeing giant monsters beating the crap out of one? <laughs> or giant robots, I mean, for that matter. Well, do you think there will be a? Uh, it'll take it on to the next one. I mean, uh, will there be another a Transformers Four? Is this franchise pretty much ran its course? I think even Michael Bay is kind of intending to pretty much let this be the final one of the series, and I think it would be a good idea to sort of leave it at a trilogy. I think that, you know, to try to risk doing more would just, you know, I don't know, I think you're just going to make enemies that way. All right, moving on to Captain America, the original hero. How, how are they billing Captain America? Because this takes place in what decade? It's in World War II. Okay. And, uh, so it starts off in World War II. It's going to finish, and yeah, this is a little bit of a spoiler, but it's going to finish in modern day, which will lead into the Avengers next summer. Oh. Uh, Captain America is actually the one comic book movie I've been most looking forward to. I cannot wait for this one. Yeah, and yeah, especially the fact that it's kind of a, I don't know, you want to call it a period piece. That kind of adds a little bit to it as well. All right, now the biggest one, and you and I, I was talking about this uh, to you a little while back, Cowboys and Aliens. I'm excited about this one. Give everybody the rundown on it. I love Westerns. This is John Favreau, the director of Iron Man, doing a classic sort of throwback to the good old-fashioned Western. It's got Daniel Craig, Harrison Ford, but here's the twist. Yeah. Cowboys fighting aliens from outer space. I mean, that in and of itself, that's selling tickets. Come on. Who doesn't want to see that on the big screen? And, you know, we go back to, like, the, uh, period pieces, too, somewhat, if you want to think about it, because it's, it's like a Western or is it a sci-fi? You put those together. Uh, I'm excited about it. I'm really excited about this. And I think it's going to gross because uh, the big stars in it as well. All righty. Uh, you talk about franchises. The Harry Potter is not going away anytime soon. And the Harry Potter and the Deathly Hallows Part 2 is out. Is this going to be the last one? I beg to differ with you. I think it is going away. <laughs> it's going away after this one. But you know what? This is the one everybody's been waiting for. This is where we're finally going to get our big epic battles, wizards fighting one another. I can't wait to see this thing on the big screen. It's going to be fantastic. It sounds like, you know, there's an amalgam of uh, something for everybody. And, Mark, we really appreciate you joining us. And if you want more information on the movies and, of course, on Mark's website, bigfanboy.com, we've got a link on our website. Have fun. Stay nice and cool inside of theaters. And there, Mark's told you which movies you need to check out this summer. Really, really cool stuff as well. So happy filming and happy movie watching as well.